Hey, it's JC. Welcome to Urban Knife Guy, where we explore the urban knife style and jungle survival. Today, I'd like to show you five urban EDC pairings that I think work together well. This is based on a YouTube series I created called Tool Times Two, where I feature a combination of two tools that I think work really well together for either urban or outdoor EDC. I think this series has gone over well with viewers and subscribers because many people have expressed enjoyment on the format and content. If you do not want to miss any video of the 2 x 2 series, do subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. It will really help the channel out. Thanks. The combination I like to share first are these two from Victorinox. This is the Victorinox Cadet in Alox. And this is the Swiss Card Nail Care version. Let's talk about the Cadet first. It's a very slim Victorinox Swiss Army knife. It's got the main blade. This is 84 millimeters, so it is on the smaller side. It's got a nail file, and it's got the two screwdrivers with the cap lifter and can opener combination. Because this is the Alox model, there are no scale tools, but this is really slim, it fits in the pocket, and is very handy, and of course, great fit and finish and quality from Victoria Knox. So because I do not have the scale tools, I think it fits very well with the Swiss card, in this case, the nail care version, because instead of the knife, it has a glass file, which I actually have used, you can actually see that, and I find it pretty handy. You also get a pair of scissors that the cadet does not have, and you get all the plus scale tools from the tweezers to fix and the pen. You also get the magnifying glass and the quadro bits, which also complement the larger screwdrivers from here. So that is a great combination. Let's have a look at another pair. This is pretty cool. Over here, I have an Olight i3T. This is in brass, and to match it in brass, this is the Traveller's Company brass pencil. Well, I'll get to it in just a bit. I think most people are familiar with Olights. This is harder to find. This is the brass version. It is heavier uh, than the other versions, but same features. It runs on a double A battery, as you can see. Uh, different modes, great brightness, great for EDC, and I really like this double clip. That means you can put it on a cap if you want. Now, over here, I've got the Traveller's Company Brass Pencil. Now, what is it? It is literally just a pencil, but it's just so cool. It is a pencil which you can just turn over just like that, and now uh, you can feel really important uh, by, you know, using this pencil. If you ever go to IKEA, don't use their pencils. You want to bring this out to look and feel special. And it's got uh, an eraser over there, and just to me, this just looks cool and together they fit perfectly as an urban EDC combination. All right, let's have a look at two more here. Uh, these are pocket tools. So we've got the Gerber Dime and another Olight. This is the IR2. So it's a mini flashlight. Also, you turn it and you can get the various brightness and modes. Still very bright, as you can see. It's a small light, but still very powerful. Now, this one works on a rechargeable uh, battery on the inside, so that's where you plug in the Type-C cable, and then you pop that in. So really handy, but very powerful. And to fit that, in my opinion, you need a pocket size tool. And this multi-tool from Gerber, I find the Gerber Dime just a nice, all black version with the pliers and you get all kinds of tools in the scales from a parcel opener to a main blade to screwdrivers and also a small pair of scissors so again everything you would need in kind of a small tool like that but if you do not want to stuff your pockets too much then you could definitely work with something like that a pair of small tools Let's go to what I call the MacGyver tool times tool, and that is basically a Swiss Army knife and some duct tape. That's right. In this case, this is actually gaffer's tape, which I prefer. There's less residue. What I had is an earbud, which I cut to size, and then I rolled the gaffer's tape over it. So that fits very nicely into the pocket or into a pouch, but very handy instead of really bringing a whole big roll. And of course, MacGyver carried a Swiss Army knife, and in the very first few episodes and throughout the series, I'm talking about the original series here, he carried the Tinker. And that is basically this knife with the back tool, which is the Phillips head screwdriver, and then you have the main blade, you have the pen blade, 
and then you got those two screwdrivers just like in the cadet I showed earlier uh, this is a larger version that's a 91 millimeter Swiss Army knife but really thin and handy for the pocket and you got scale tools in the form of tweezers and toothpick as well and together this again makes a great MacGyver combination as I called it and one final pairing I thought I'll show you that's quite interesting is what I call the old school cool urban EDC and what I have here is the British Army knife a really old style kind of a multi-tool knife because there is a can opener over here and we've got a peanut lighter let's uh, talk about this British Army knife first so this is made in Sheffield England made of stainless steel sheep's foot style blade very utilitarian uh, really nice and solid blade you can hear that snap and then we have this over here very aggressive can opener you even have kind of a mini pry bar large flathead screwdriver here for this this is a peanut lighter and uh, i have got this hemp wick all around it uh, which is soaked in beeswax it acts as kind of a wick and actually uh, this sits in my survival tin which i've shared before you can check it out in the link in the card above or the description below and you know what i've filled this about two years ago and look at that it still lights this is pretty amazing i think i did a video after one year to showing it still lights and now it's almost another year it still lights i have not refilled this but together to me this is old school cool so you have that you've got that macgyver setup and then you've got all these that i shared as well well that's my five urban EDC combinations based on the two times two series. I hope you enjoyed it. Which of these combinations do you like the most? And do you have your favorite combination? Do let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Oh, by the way, if you'd like to purchase any of these items, and I'm not trying to push them on you, but a lot of people I know might be interested in certain items, especially things like the peanut lighter or this traveler's company brass pen, uh, do check out my Amazon store. I have them listed under the urban EDC gear category. So do check those out. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like the content in general, please subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.